Class is in session. I'm taking notes. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Palatka, Florida, Michelle McCool. The first ever Divas Champion in WWE history. Driven by faith, heart, and soul with a mean streak even longer than her legs. Yeah, Michelle McCool is used to standing tall in more ways than one. Michelle McCool told me that she's surrounded by a division that's jealous of her success and leadership. That's some real talk right there. Ah, more like real egotistical and delusional. spearheaded a movement to take this women's division to a level of competition it has never seen before. It's about time I heard you pay the queen her proper respect, Saxton. It was Charlotte who only took a couple months after her, de her debut to win her first championship here in WWE. And Charlotte hasn't looked back since. Charlotte Flair has reached a point in her career where she truly has nothing left to prove. That is true, Michael, but Charlotte defines herself as excellence and refuses to she keep her down. She kicks out with authority after two. If she keeps the pressure on, the next one might do it. She sent flying into the corner, countering the queen. Ouch. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. And the clothesline. arm drag. She steers clear of that one. Score boy pinning combination. Oh, maybe not. But power. No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Uh-oh. Dragon sleeper applied. This could be it. You can see the end. Showing the world just how much fight she's got left. to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Up high! Whoa, look out! It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring, there is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Charlotte with a nice reversal. She's getting back into the ring. Michelle is feeling it now. Ooh. Lock it in, the dragon sleeper! Showing the world just how much fight she's got left. Put it in the corner now. Oh, I saw it coming. 
Using their boot on the throat in the corner. That's telling your opponent, you don't deserve to share this stage with me. So ruthless. This match is wearing her down. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. So much damage inflicted. Watch this display of power. Sit up, powerbomb. Staved off that attack. Got the front face lock applied. Nice suplex. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh, man. Looks like her opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. Strong takedown there. Her shoulders are down. Gets the shoulder up in one. Not getting the two at this point has got to say something. Made her pay for her mistake. And another counter. Ooh, the forearm connects. Big impact off the neck breaker. Shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. She begins to stir back up, but does it look good? Up high. Good lord. Taking flight. You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. McCool falling victim to a surge of attacks here. Michelle might be feeling a bit rattled. She is going to look to press on the advantage. Could be a chance for Michelle to change the complexion of this match. Kick to the gut, double under hook by Michelle McCool. Delivering wings of love. Thrown back in under the ropes. Sight set on the top rope. From the top. in the waning moments of this match. She slips outside. What has she got in mind? Boot to the gut will stop anyone in their tracks. Turning the tables. These competitors have been going deep into the arsenal of all mass, but have not found a way to end it at all. Swings in momentum. Every push has been cut off. Nice 
Balance into a double knee drop. And now she delivers her back into the ring. Charlotte Flair with a trademark chopping. Oh, natural selection by Charlotte. Will that overtake the pool? She kicks out. I don't believe it. How did that not end things for her? She's showing incredible resiliency. And Charlotte will have to go back to the drawing board to try and get things back where she wants them. That'll turn your lights out. And we see the attention being put on the torso area. Michelle McCool trying to fire herself up. She's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Well, right after the shit. Nasty dragon school. Will be ended here. She kicks out with force. That is just pure instinct at this point. Charlotte down a peg or two. I think so too.